So Hao Guang Yang prepared a little demonstration of a four bar linkage for comparisons between um, the Arduino round robin scheduler and the uh, scheduling that we have been com talking about. For example, rate monotonic, earliest deadline first, etc. Um, and so what we're going to uh, look at here is uh, just this quick example of uh, in the context of this is basically four tasks have been created um, to uh, control uh, this four bar linkage with an Arduino and then there's an extra task just to kind of um, control, uh, consume a lot of uh, resources. So the Arduino is directly driving a, a, a DC motor um, and this task D is going to be increased so that we have more than 100% utilization. And so here you can see the four bar linkage going back and forth. Now listen to the sound. And note the swinging of the four bar. Now this is a real time display of the uh, release of some of these tasks and actually some of the jitter that is happening um, in this uh, as the uh, four bar linkage operates. Um, now again, this is not a fully loaded task. Um, and so what we're looking, what we're looking to see here is you know what is happening to jitter. Um, and the performance as we then increase loading on the CPU. Um, and again, what this is, is a look at what the delay is, the latency from the, uh, um, so the latency of each task from the time it releases. Now, which is the, and this has a directing impact on uh, control quality. Um, so what we're going to do now is just increase the execution rate of task D, which is kind of this, this superfluous task, um, and then uh, look and uh, not only notice the uh, effect on the sweep angle, but this is the sound that the, um, sim the roughly 1,000 hertz is what it is. Now here we go again, listen to the sound. Again, it's a much rougher sound, and the uh, uh, trajectory is not making the full coverage that it was in the previous, and that's in the previous example, and again, that's because of the um, less significant task, this task D, um, consuming resources and not respecting the priorities that normally go with an RMA. Um, so again, the PD controller misses several deadlines uh, in addition to uh, the trajectory generator um, and uh, therefore it doesn't quite uh, um, stack up and in fact we get sound, uh, you know, a, a much rougher sound of the uh, um, device. Okay? You can actually hear that it's not performing as well.